Oh, we've got Stefan Street. Brilliant. Now then, here we go. Mm. How are we doing, Stefan? I'm good. How are you? I'm hot. <laughs> it's yes. hot. We're talking about people weighing in. I'm, I feel like I'm making weight. I legit have right, like, beads of sweat yeah. rolling down my back. You must be boiling. No, I, I was just walking outside, running, running, making my way here, my, sweating my 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 beard. Boys, <laughs> well, let me just interrupt you for a split second before we obviously wait yeah, we go. with you, Stefan. Uh -huh. Leon Edwards is about to hit the scales. Obviously, we've just been speaking about Bobby coming to weigh in and why he weighed in. Oof. It might all be irrelevant if this young man now hits 170 he pounds. He took that scale with a jump bang. on there. Yeah, didn't he? Easy. Bang on the official for Leon main event? There you go, ladies and gentlemen. We have a main event, just in case you have just tuned in. Leon Edwards, the champion, weighing in at championship weight, 170 pounds. Earlier on, Kamara Usman weighed in. Yes, we do have a backup fighter who will probably get the next title shot after this fight is completed, but we've got a title fight. It's Leon Edwards taking on Kamara Usman. Stephen Struve, let's get back to you, my man. What have you made of the pomp and ceremony of, uh, of this London card this week? There seems to be a real buzz in the air and excitement from the, from the fan base in particular. Yeah, no, it's been a long time. We shared the card in Manchester, and it's been a long time since they had a pay-per-view, so and they also didn't have you know let the fighters fight middle of the night we fought at like yeah, 5 a.m. Yeah, so yeah. this is really nice so no it's 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 great yeah and Leon Edwards just looked amazing he looked really fit yeah like, yeah barely faced by the by the weight cut when you look at Leon and Kamara uh -huh. you know obviously Kamara's the wrestler yeah. Leon's got better striking but can we get a little prediction or how do you think this one plays out um, I'm really curious of course uh, we all know that Kamara wants to fight at the fence Put him against the fence, take him down, yeah. wear and tear on him. So really, really interesting to see if Leon is going to be more active, yeah. more confident about because of the last win, of course. So um, if it really curious to see if it's going to play out really different from the last yeah. fight because of what happened the last time. So it, we'll see tomorrow. Do you expect Kamaru to come out early on, knowing what happened in the last second of the last fight, the head kick, the knockout? Do you think he'll rush him for a takedown? Do you think he'll be looking to take Leon down just to take it to his own? Comfort place early on. Um, not sure if he's going to do that uh, right in the first round, but I think that's that's the only game plan for him. If he, if, if it's going to be on the distance, Leon wants it to be. It's it's going to be a very hard night for Kamara, of course. So um, you always see that Kamara is looking for his for, for his distance, for his take now. So man. Really looking forward Steph, to it. So yeah. interesting. Let, let me ask you. Obviously, yeah. you've had many many fights. Um, they always say when you get knocked well some people say when you get knocked out uh -huh. you won't be the same fighter right mm -hmm. what do you think because i disagree with that it depends on the individual obviously we're talking about kamara uzman who's one of the best we've ever seen yeah. inside there how do you think he will be saturday night when he steps in the octagon i think he'll be able to deal with it mentally yeah I think it's um, what, what you say. Uh, sure it really depends on Stephen. the fighter. Yeah, so. Yeah, so. Yeah, yeah. Just, just bashing up the, yeah. you know, the, the best heavyweight we've ever seen. One of, just one of, one of, one of, one of my, one of my better performances. <laughs> that was here as well. That was Nottingham. Uh, was Nottingham, Nottingham, yeah, Nottingham. Yeah, Nottingham. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah, always nice to see that. It is always nice. It's to always see being that. brought back when Steve yeah, is yeah. about to fight, and I'm like, "Yeah, that was me. That was me." <laughs> the glory days. Yeah, the glory days. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Obviously, Steph is now working in the media, uh -huh. working with the gang this weekend. You know what I mean? Yeah. This is yeah. Like, yeah. Doing, be, the, doing the backstage stuff, doing the, the interviews with the fighters, Paul's fight as well. Yeah. Because that's always an interesting dynamic. Speaking to uh -huh. those that win, relatively yeah. straightforward. But speak to those that haven't been so successful too uh, i don't really think we do those anymore i think we we let them you know yeah. <laughs> enjoy the, the the peace and quiet but it's it's always fun and it's good uh, so for the fighters like it they they see me backstage they see a, a fellow fighter yeah. who knows what what it feels like to be in there and it uh so far so good so yeah it's fun yeah good man listen yeah. um we've got uh, crystal yep. to uh, come join us on the show so I will, I, I will let you get on stefan thanks you guys all the best stefan good to see you mate thank you sir um good man if we could bring in 